Can you have a straw poll to choose what country I play as? Dude, do you know how many countries there are? Look at, look at all these. You want me to type in every single one? You are out your mind. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm just going to do random. I'm new to this game. And I'm just going to do random because why not? Why not? I mean, what does fraternity think about this? I don't know. They, they seem pretty happy. They seem happy with my decision. Just finished my last my last day videos. Man. I wanted the last day's mod to work. It may still work. Someone linked me a patch that may fix it. I'll give it one more shot. Uh, let's go with a standard map. A player's 16 city-states. We'll go with a... Normal difficulty, I guess, on something new. Uh, thank you, GGG, for following the channel. You know, Warrior of the Empire, service well. I don't love you? What? Which Cuckoo, Cuckoo Rumi do I own? What? What is that? This is gonna be a rage stream? Nah. Nah, I don't think it's gonna be a rage stream. Alright, let's go for it. Oh, well, actually, can we do random? Here, we'll do random map type as well. How about that? Great! And I'm an older lady. Maria Teresa, Holy Roman Empress and Sovereign of Austria. The people bow to your gracious Thank will. Thank you, Rented Ark, for following the channel. Following the death of your now, father, warrior King of Charles the VI, well. you ascended to the throne of Austria during a time of great instability. Hello, Gabrisi. But the empty coffers and diminished military did little to dissuade your ambitions. Faced with war almost immediately upon your succession to the throne, you managed to fend off your foes and in naming your husband Francis Stephen co-ruler, assured your place as Empress of the Holy Roman Empire. During your reign, you guided okay. Austria on a new path of reform. I like this history. Strengthening the military. A Kugurumi is a furry treasury, outfit. Oh, um, I'd probably go with of the all of them then. Oh, great queen. Yep, I've always wanted to be an old lady, Joseph. This is the true. time has come for you to rise and guide the kingdom once again. So, Can you uh, shut up, voice. To the height of prosperity and splendor? Will you know, build okay. a civilization that stands the test of time? Are we done? Are we done. All right, so what do we get? Now, the thing is, I don't even know what their usual strengths are, because we have two more added here. So we got an Hussar. Uh, has extra sight, something about flanking attack, and ignores building defense. And then we have a Landwehr, a gunpowder unit. That's not going to come until much later. Replaces the Rifleman. Mountain Troop. Homeland Guardian and ignores building defense. An Orchestra. Great work of music slots required too. I don't know what that means. Oh, great, and a coffee house. I think this is all like mid-game stuff, from what I can tell. Alright, begin our journey. Here we are. Here we are. It's a free suit ability you get to buy an ally city state. Oh really? This is a good no. place to No no, find. no 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 shut up. Shut up. No. What do we got? We got crabs. Excellent, I always wanted crabs. We have two things of crabs next to us. Alright, so we can use one for us and maybe diplomacy one off later. We got fur, we got deer, we got wheat, we got a lot of food. Thank you, Kyle, for following the channel. You're never a uh, warrior of the Empire service well. I'm also using the enhanced UI mod as well. So this may not look normal to some of you if you don't play with the enhanced UI mod. It basically just gives you information on this screen that you could find out by going into menus anyway. All right, let's find a city. Uh, Vienna. The city screen provides okay. a detailed no, view. shut up. So what I kind of like about this is you can hover over the city and you see exactly what tiles are being worked and what tile is going to be most likely purchased with your next uh, culture growth. That's pretty cool. One of the unique things. And now we are going to start scouting out. The first thing we're going to do... First thing we're going to do... I kind of like culture. Let's go to Monument. How about that? How about that? Choose research. Uh, so 
shut up. What's next to us here? We got the wheat and the deers, and we got fur and more deer. We got we have no horses. Trapping would give us some stuff on the deer tiles and fur tiles, some what gold in production. And then we had wheat, which requires a farm. Which you start with anyway. Okay. So that doesn't matter. I guess the first thing we should go for is trapping to try and maximize our stuff. We'll do that then. Get animal husbandry as well. Why not? Excuse no. me. No. Oh. That's the first turn, I think. Also, up here, it tells you exactly what's going on with each one of your cities. So, uh, we have culture growth in 15 turns, population growth in 8 turns, and whatever you're working on done in 8 turns as well. And it shows you the population right there. So, I really like this enhanced UI mod. It's really cool. Spamming archery. You can spam all you want. Actually, don't spam all you want, because that'll be annoying. I'm going to choose what I want to choose. No. You're going to go that way. And next turn. Horses appear on the map after you grab the tech. Okay, cool. Hello, Lise. Welcome. Hello, Scatterplats. Why don't I ever upload Civ 5? This is the first time I've played Civ 5. So that's probably why I don't upload it. Yeah, what are we, a spearman? That's pretty cool. That's huge. One, I'm going to get a scout here soon, too. Next turn. Ooh. Barbarians. More crabs. Okay. Uh, I don't think I really want to... Well, nah, screw it. Yeah, I guess we should fight them right now. We have spearmen. We're going to be stronger than they are. Although that defensive bonus makes it a little bit tight. I have to upload it before I even play it? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're right. I should upload it before I play it. I'm pretty silly. Ooh, sugar. Another luxury resource. Yeah! Okay. Next turn. Monument's almost up. Attack again. Town with Mountain Blade raised the Civ 5 banner. <laughs> no. I was actually trying out a Clash of Kings mod today to see if I was going to cover that next, but like I said earlier, someone linked me a um, patch for the last days, so I may give that a shot. The problem is the patch requires a new game, so I'd have to play through quite a lot. I thank you to Dragon Doctor for following the channel. You're now a warrior of the Empire. Serve us well. You know, got a promotion. I will. Let's go with uh, drill. Gives us combat strength and rough terrains. And now we get a minor victory. Yeah, f those barbarians. Hello, King Bearface. Hello, Dragon Doctor. Dragon Dentist is the worst of them. <laughs> yeah, I probably wouldn't want to see one. I have some information. No, no, thank you. All right, so I'm going to give a scout. I think scouts are pretty important. Next turn. Thank you. Decisive victory. All right. Twenty-five gold and cows. And is that the same sugar I saw earlier? Yeah, it is. Okay. Well, let's uh, go that way next. Hello, Mr. Dill Pickle. Thou shalt not muzzle the ox when he treadeth out the corn. Thank you. Hey, look at that. We have horses right next to us. Well, that is cool. More horses down there. I'm thinking this is going to be another good spot for a city. Hmm. 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 Well, we have to keep exploring. Probably in here. You made that account ten minutes ago? <laughs> Dedication. Devotion, even. Uh, we're going to have a scout done in one turn, so let's heal these guys up for right now before I scout anymore. I don't want to run into any more barbarians. Uh, yes, Kyle, I know that they, they heal when they fortify. I do know some basics. Please stop spamming. 
Oh my god, please stop spamming, for real. Okay, let's have the scout go this way. And I want to get a worker, I think. Twelve turns. Jesus. Alright, yeah, okay. Twelve turns is so long. Find something- ooh! We have found gold. Alright, so usually, because I'm a military guy, I adapt honor. But, uh, that may not be the best choice for this faction. I haven't messed around at all with Faith, because that wasn't around when I played this game. So perhaps I should do Piety. Adopting Piety allows you to build shrines and temples in half the usual time. Adopting all policies in this tree grants a great profit to appear, and Holy Sites provide plus three culture. I didn't even know there were Holy Sites in this game. Liberty is rapid expansion. Okay. Tradition increases the rate at which border expansion cities and also grants culture in the capital. Unlocks hanging gardens. Adopting all policies in the tradition tree will unlock increased growth and a free aqueduct in your first four cities. It also allows you to build great engineers with faith. Hmm. Honor is the best. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I mean, I like honor. Giving you the combat bonus versus barbarians, and then you get culture each with uh, each barbarian you kill. That's ah, fine. We'll go honor. That's what I know. We'll grab it. Dios bendiga a aquellos que lo merezcan. Soy Isabel de España. Well, hello, Isabel. The anointed queen of Spain. Am I a heathen or a believer? I believe that we should say goodbye. Alright, so there's her warriors, so she must be up there. Dude, there are so many crabs around here. Im Namen des großen deutschen Volkes heiße ich euch willkommen. Uh, hi. German spearmen. Oh, elephants. And three sheep. And fish. This is a great place to get a lot of food. More barbarians. We should send our spearmen up there to kill him since we have honor. More barbarians. Borders of Vienna has grown. Great. Great. You're almost fully healed. Let's start sending you up. Ooh! A natural wonder. Here is something that may be helpful. Six faith points if worked. Gain two happiness if it's within your border. But people are telling me that I shouldn't mess around with faith my first time. Hmm. I mean, does that change it though? If you find a natural wonder like that? Ah, oh, man. Hmm. Let's go that way. Buffalo. Cotton. Okay. There's a city-state right there. I have some information. Yep. We're happy. No worries. No worries. There we go. We have met them. City states are small cut. Yeah. All right. So they are cultured, which is pretty cool. But they are hostile, hostile towards us. Oh. Hmm. During protection, your resting bo points for influence at the city state increase by five. Let's pledge to protect. Sure. I will protect you. Kinda. Of. <laughs> you gotta have faith, the faith, the faith. Hello, Draco Miner. There's a lot of dragons in the stream. 
All right, so our spearmen's going up there to kill barbarians. Finding more horses. Even brute beasts and wandering birds do not fall into. The Thank you, voice. Another city-state, who are friendly and militaristic. They know the secrets of the centaur. <laughs> what? Pledge to protect. Hmm. I kind of want to get bronze working. Because I like the spearmen. Yeah, sure. I will take that policy. Uh, thank you, Moist Whopper, hmm, for following the channel. You're now a warrior of the Empire. Serve us well. So I like this, the warrior code, which gives increased production when training melee units and a great general. I like that. I'm gonna grab that. Warrior's code. Oh, happy day. Shut up. There's a great general. Uh, we will send them up with the spearmen, but have to make sure that he does not die. Or, I mean, get captured and, well, killed. Okay, so I am going to have you, I guess, work that. Oh, jeez. Wow. Did you, your places are on, are on fire. That doesn't look like a kind gentleman. At least the background doesn't look kind. Uh oh. Hmm. Let's grab a settler. I think I'm going to fortify them to heal them up all the way. Wait for the great general to get up there and help them. Go on from there. Hey, we're fourth place. More fish. Alright, you fortify up there. You start making the camp. Uh, he can build a fort, but I don't really see a reason to right now. We would like to set up an embassy in our capital. What do you think? They're going to give us a gold per turn for 30 turns if I accept their embassy? Is this a bad thing? I'll, I'll accept it. He's giving me money. Welcome to Vienna, I guess. Where was that? Over there. Okay. Well, that is the coast, so let's start moving back this way. Es wäre in eurem Interesse, dass ihr dieses Angebot sorgfältig prüft. Someone says I can get more gold out of this? Okay. Can I get three gold a turn? In Ordnung. Really? Huh, okay. Oh, I see. So that tells them where I am. Okay. That's fine. You can come and try and build, burn my cities. Ooh. We should be alright. I don't think they leave their camp unless they spawn one.
Yes. Give me culture. Can I tell you the settings of this game? It's on normal difficulty, random Civ start. So that's why I have Austria. Uh, it was on a random map type. So I'm not sure what the, it is yet. We have eight opponents, I think, and 16 city states. I think. The meek. Mining. All right, go on there. Attack. Almost. We almost got them. Can I play with? Um, I'm only just playing C5 right now. I'm up man. Doing this uh, single player game. Ah, Barcelona. I wonder if we can become friends. Oh, jeez. Yeah, sure. Drill 2. Finish the camp. Get the gold. Move on there so you don't die. Oh, hello. Aloha Pumehana Homika Ioe Kehoa. Owo Okumehameha. Mo Io Kealala Nimo. You seem friendly. Haha! Be afraid. Alright, so we have a major victory, but... Hmm... Ah, sure, let's go for it. And then maybe we'll sit here and fortify for a bit. You will go to sleep. Furs are up. Uh, sure, I'll build a farm. Alright, let's uh, go this way. I probably should be scouting out over here, too. Woo! Woo! Fortify until healed. We'll get them. Actually, hold on. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to stay fortified. I'm afraid if I take them... Actually, if I take them out, then they shouldn't be able to move and attack me, I don't think. This should- this may- I hope this is safe! And then we move the Great General. We get culture for killing. Because of course we do. Hmm. Alright, yeah, I'll move my scout down now. Go that way. Alright, so we need you to fortify. You need to go back to sleep. Next turn. And I guess next turn. see a lot of wheat. Yeah, we got wheat right there. We got wheat down there. A lot of wheat up there. Wheat all over the place. Bogota seeks a great musician. Uh, I do not have a great musician. Sorry, Bogota. Farm is up. We have no. Alright, so we got our settler. I wanted to take them down here, but there is a barbarian camp there now. Which is unfortunate. But that is where I want to expand. So I'm going to put them to sleep. Hmm. <sighs> 
Hmm. Looks like a long time to get my spearmen down there. Shoot. Uh, thank you, Cicero the Faithful, for following the channel. You're now warrior of the Empire. Serve us well. Uh, take care of Free McDonald. Hmm. My warriors suck. But I don't have access to uh, Spearman yet, so... I'll just have to do that. Start building a camp over there. I think I want to start moving my Spearman down. Keep my Great General with them. And I need to take them out. Help the city-states who pledged who I pledged to. Uh, okay, so them? Defeat the barbarian units that are invading their city. Well, hey, look, you know... I'll try. Build the camp. 50% more experience. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Why not? Here, Hector, with a spear eleven cubits long in his hand. Hmm. I'll finish the warrior. Am I using anything else besides enhanced UI? Uh, nothing that I know of that would add more resources? Other than just all the DLC of the game? I can spend money to absorb sea states into your empire since I'm Austria. How do I do that? Like, give the goat a uh, gift? Is that how I would do that? Uh, masonry, stone and marble. I don't think we have any of that around us, do we? So that is not a pressing concern. The only iron I even see is up here. Currently. Hmm. Hmm. Let's grab the wheel. And then we'll grab Archie on the way. You do the diplomatic marriage when they are your ally. Oh, okay, thank you, Tomek. 